Hello everyone, welcome to Viz Cocina. Today I am going to review this curler, not heat curler, and uh, I got it on Amazon, and it was actually um, approximately like $9.99 when I got it. I mean, you just have to, um, you have, it comes with a clip, and then you put it all around, and you roll your hair like this way, and curl your hair backwards like that. And then on the end, you just clip it towards the end, and you know, basically grab your last tip and um, roll it back. I mean, it's a little complicated, the process of doing that, and I kind of feel like this one is going all over the place. Let me see if I can actually uh, show you guys. Um, I'm gonna try to do this side here so you guys can see the differences, you know, and see if it's worth the effort of doing this. Let me get this, um, this pole here. So you guys can so can hold it better because the reality is that it's a little bit hard to explain but i am going to show you guys how there are different step of doing this and um this is one of them um would i recommend um doing the heatless curls mm, well I think it's worth it. Um, I don't know how you would sleep with this. I would say do it more during the day. Let me try to see if I can put this in here so you guys can see better. And I'm gonna try to do the, the curls right now. Like I, I already did this area here. I'm gonna do this one, but you're gonna see. I had it approximately for an hour already. And you guys can probably see how the curls are looking. This one for the right one, I don't know, it tends to come out a little bit because I have my layers. So um, it's a little hard for it to stay still. I don't even know where I put the other, the other, um, another plastic thing. But, but I just wrap it around and then this is how it's going to look. So those the curl, literally, it's doing your little curls right here. And it's supposed to be like, like that. So you can see that the curls are already taking effect. But what I noticed is that the, the curls are actually doing it up. It's not doing it up here. So I definitely want to grab the hair like this and then start putting it back. And then you're gonna continue grabbing a little bit of the hair from here and then continue putting it back. Like right here. And then you're gonna continue wrapping it. And I think I'm gonna go back and do the other one because obviously um, this is... So you're gonna wrap it, continue wrapping your hair, and try to maintain it as tight as possible because obviously you want those curls to get. But on the bottom, it's gonna be that difficult because you can grab the whole thing. This is a little bit more difficult than I thought it's going to be. So you're gonna wrap it and you're gonna continue wrapping your hair like this. And I have to say the curls, I'm starting to like it this way better than actually the other way that I did it because obviously um, it doesn't get the curls on top to adjust very well. Obviously that clip allow you to keep it in place. So when you go get all the way down here, the idea is to try to curl that tip and then just do this. And then you're going to grab that headband and turn it around as tight as you can because you don't want it to go anywhere. And let's keep going. Okay. And then that is supposed to be how it's supposed to be. I do have to say that it does get a little bit loose and I don't know why it gets loose. <clears throat> it makes um, like loose effect like that. I'm gonna go and try to do the other side and when you do do the other side, look, this is like almost like an hour of me doing it and you can see that the curls are coming the fine and getting there. But the top part is I'm not getting that much curl which is why I'm trying to wrap it on top a little bit more like here. So this way, we get the curls also coming from here too. 
So, I mean, obviously you get the curls and you can see them and you want like natural curls without any heat. So, I'm going to try to continue doing this and then grabbing the back and then you're going to grab the back of your hair and you're going to try to tie it as much as you can because that is the, the point of it, to tie it. And you're going to continue tying and hopefully it's tight enough that your curls are going to be, obviously, they are getting there and you're going to continue curling it. Well, the curls, are, I hope they turn out nice. I have a khaki ball tonight. It's a Navy event where the new chief selects uh, get introduced to the mess. And I think I have talked about it before. So definitely it's something worth it. I don't know where that my other uh, thing went. Who knows where it went. So I'm using one of the girls stuff to try to get it all tight in there but as you can see this one is coming out so they want you want to be able to get it like as tight as possible and and make sure that everything is tight okay so this is going to be my review on this non-heat curl it okay this is getting, getting there okay uh so I so far I mean I am trying to get them to align the hardest part for me is this here because literally um, my bang are a little bit shorter in here so trying to get the bang to adjust to there is just a deal anyway um, I'm going to take another video once my curls are done we're gonna leave them for at least I will leave them at least for three more hours and hopefully see how they go. Three hours after running around, uh, maybe put my dress on, do my makeup and things like that. And then I will come back and show you how the curls look afterwards. I'm, I would recommend to put a little bit of spray to keep them because obviously I fly on my hair already. But I didn't put anything on it. I just fly on my hair, I put the curler. My hope is that those natural curls will come automatically, but my hair is curly but I can see that the curls might take, um, you see, the curls supposed to be like that, like a natural curls. And I'm, I'm seeing that some of them are poking through, so I definitely want to make sure that that happens. Anyway, I'll show you guys next time and see what happens, uh, the end result. Okay, so here we go. Let's see how those uh, curlers work out. Um, I'm gonna take them off one at a time. Let's see if I can put this somewhere so you guys can see the end result. Hmm, that's the problem. I'm trying to find a place where I can put this phone. Let me see. Stand. Oh, there's always a stand somewhere, but when you're looking for them, you can never find them. Okay, anyway, let's see how I can schedule this thing. Okay. Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna take the one on the bottom first and see what do we have here. So this is like the curls did. Huh, not that bad. I think they came out pretty good in that side. Let's see the other one. The other one, I don't feel like they came out that way because they're already coming out. So maybe I didn't tie it off enough. Uh, we'll see what the end result is going to be. It's been three hours. It's actually it's been less than three hours. It's been like two hours and a half. And I just want to see how it turn out. So I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take. You guys saw how um I have like a flat here. It wasn't very curly. So now we. Are so I love the curls in this side. I obviously did a better job on this side than this one. And this one, I, I think I'm gonna have to curl it myself a little bit, but I am loving the curls that I got from this side. And I don't know if you guys can see, but I think it's worth definitely investing into the curls. Um, I feel like my curls are pretty defined here. 
don't know if you guys can see it, but this is how I look. This side didn't actually took it so well. And, but everything else looks, the curls are great here too. The only thing that I didn't took was this part here. But like I said, this is the part that is hard to do because you have to grab a sew box, so. My recommendation is uh, the heatless curl. It's definitely worth it. I think that um, the curls are really coming along, as you can see. You have like very cute curls. And then this one here is less curly, obviously. But if you take this away, you can see the curls are very well defined. And you actually can see that the curls um, didn't come out as great as I would love to. But keep in mind, I guess I didn't tighten them enough over here. But I have to say that if you do a good job of tying them up, you can definitely get this kind of effect with that um, curling iron. Um, so in here, I might have to do a little bit of curls here, which I didn't want to apply any heat, but as you can see, these curls are more defined than this one. Obviously, you can see the difference. This is straight, this one isn't. So I love the fact that the curls came out. I recommend using a little bit of spray to keep the curls intact, because I don't know if they can, might go away. After a while, that is up, but I definitely recommend the heatless curl. I think it's worth the investment for $9.99. You can actually get heatless curl without having to do too much. I just flat iron my hair and I definitely just did, did everything else. But so far, I definitely recommend it. Um, I mean, I obviously need to do a better job at getting it tighter in this eye if I'm going to do that. But I'll see you next time on Beast Cocina. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, this is me getting ready for my khaki ball and I hope that um, you guys buy that heatless curl because I think it is worth the look. You take, do get those curls and don't have to apply that much um, that much of a, a heat to it. I'm definitely going to curl this up a little bit here. But that's nothing because I obviously everything else is curled so I don't have to do too much. But I like and what do you guys think? Is it worth the investment? I certainly think it's worth the investment because for $9.99, you actually get English curls. You don't have to do rollers or whatever. This thing is actually pretty good and it comes with so many items already for $9.99. I'm I will put um, it in the description so you guys can actually pick it. Anyway, I'll see you next time, Beast Casina. And if you guys like this kind of video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, let me know too. It's all about, um, but I hope that you like this review. It's actually, um, I think it comes very handy if you don't want to heat up your, your, your curls. Yesterday I did my mask, and um, as you can see, my how shiny my hair is. It's perfect. Um, so I like the red um, so I'm probably going to use a little spray just for them to stay, but otherwise, I think it's a good job. I'll see you next time. I'll be and if no one tell you, you're special just the way you are. I'll see you next time.